Hello folks, welcome to another episode of Kingdom Come Deliverance. Uh, we had started a quest last time, the Waldensians, where we have a situation. Uh, the vicar's in Ushets. <laughs> I can't hide that name. Uh, Sir Hanush wants the vicar out. Father, Father Godfrey, Godwin, okay I'm missing it up. Father Godwin wants the vicar out, and the vicar wants the heretics out. And guess who's tasked with finding the heretics? Henry is. We have a lead that's way out of town, and we're about to go check it out. Uh, so I believe we're going to finish up the Waldensians quest. And then there's a nearby human camp in the woods. Uh, I'll probably take care of that too, at least I hope to. So there's my information. Thank you. I really appreciate your likes and shares. Check out my website. And I'm trying to build up my subscriber base too. You can check out all the other videos I have on here. So, thank you. Yeah. Now this does seem to be... Oh, there is a way into the loft. Of course, a horse out here you'd think would arouse suspicion just by itself. Alright. Let's maybe get into a stealth gear. But let's go... Yeah, hopefully I won't have a need for the trough. That probably means that I've failed. Ah. I could try listening from here. Ah. I could try listening from here. That would be a good spot. They have a ladder somewhere. That looks like I have to be around here. So let's wait. Although it could throw me into a cutscene, I don't know. Get here. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, bless us, O Lord, and these thy gifts which we are bound to receive from thy bounty. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. 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 They... They took old Vensel to the presbytery today. Vensel. His farm is nearby. It's only a matter of time before... Before they come for me. I know. And what are we going to do about it? That vicar is baying for blood, the beast. He will devour you alive. I do not intend to do anything about it. I shall not waver from my faith, nor turn my back on it. My dear, what on earth are you saying? If they come for me, I will go quietly. And I will not lie. Are you serious? Don't you know what they'll do to you? I can well imagine. But I am resolved. The Lord have mercy. Do not fear. I surrender to God's will. And I do not condemn you if you decide to leave. I'll stay by your side. Although I'd rather that you decided otherwise. I know. And you have no fear, my brothers in Christ. Stay true to God's plan, as I shall. Go and spread the true faith amongst all good folk. I'm sorry. I wish there was another way. You should eat your supper and depart right away. Who knows? You may come for us at dawn. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, uh, let's see if it passed Mr. the vicar or talk to Father Godwin. Hmm. Okay. Uh, so let's just look at the journal. Oh, uh, it's got on the wrong one. Okay, Waldensians. 
So pass message to the vicar, optional talk to Father Godwin. And there's helping Father Godwin help the Bowers. Okay, so I think this is a complicated one. Now, if it was me personally, you know, Christians are Christians, whichever method they buy, you know, I don't care. It's really just slight different interpretations on the same religions. I wouldn't care. I wouldn't be getting a family hurt over this. Um, so now, how would Henry do it? I guess if he thought there was heretics and, uh, you know, Henry's a godly person, he might be interested in flushing them out. Now the wild card comes in with Godwin and Hanush because I can imagine what the vicar will do, but Hanush doesn't really want a problem and Godwin doesn't really want a problem. So... I think one thing Henry could easily do is, like, he would just go straight to the vicar, but I almost still feel like it's optional, like I should talk to Father Godwin to see what the other option is. Oh, I haven't really read this last paragraph here. But the fact was led by a woman, Mistress Bower. Okay. Well, now i got to sneak out without being heard. I suppose that's still a possibility. Oh, is someone down there? I'm like hearing things. Hey, good of you, horse, to hang out here all day. <laughs> Alright, I'm wondering if I'm not digging a bad hole for myself in this. But going to talk to Father Godwin first to... I thought was... Her... Oh. That's funny, I thought I was reading that he was back here according to the map. That's if he's actually up here. They must. Oh, hello. Well, I know I can wake him up. I suppose for the sake of the quest, we shall. Because I don't want to waste any time. <coughs> The Bower Farm. So, I went to check on the Bower Farm, and I don't have good news. Do tell. They most certainly are heretics. At least as far as I can tell. Are you sure? What did you hear? Um, both of them can, yeah. That could apply to anybody. So let's just try this. Well, for a start, the evening prayers were led by a woman. That is certainly unusual, but nothing conclusive in itself. But that's not all. And they're afraid of the vicar. They're afraid the vicar will be coming after them. Who wouldn't fear that? That swine finds fault with everyone. Well, it's not like you'd have to try too hard. Mrs. Bower plans to confess everything. Confess what, exactly? Most likely her faith. Yeah, that in here. The people of the farm were trying to discourage that, but her mind's made up. Oh, good lord, that's all I need. What am I to do? <laughs> we have to help them. Okay. So, we have to help them. Mm, Henry likely wouldn't. They are heretics, but we don't want to stir up too much trouble. So, if she wants to confess, maybe this can be done more quietly. Which, I still feel bad about this, knowing the Middle Ages. I mean, I personally don't care, you know. But, going with Henry, trying to play the role of the time. I think this might be 
the best route out he'd pick. She's planning to confess. What would you like to do? You have to talk them out of it, Hal. You must convince them to run. <laughs> I like that, but I'm the one who's supposed to catch them. <laughs> uh, um, that's easy for you to say. Okay. Um, I think this is the funniest thing I'm hearing. I don't see where this is an alternative. Um, I'm the one who's supposed to catch them. He'll probably just say, well, let them outrun you or something like that. Easy for you to say. I, I don't know. Wouldn't there still be a heretic hunt or something if they run? Me? And what am I supposed to say to them? I'm the one who's been hunting them down. So who better? Do you think they'll listen to me? I'm a priest. If there's anyone they can't abide, it's me. You have to try <laughs> at least. For their own good and for yours, Hal. Uh, so do we try that or try that or in the middle? <coughs> And partly I feel like if I'm not going to do it, I should just say, and if I do it, I should just do it. Uh, I'd be like that, but I think I just have to go one way or the other. Let's see. Maybe I could do this, and I'll still be forced to say one way or the other. I'll have to think about it. Talking to them could be dangerous. Nonsense. If you haven't told anyone else, then only the two of us know the truth. And what if they confess anyway in the end, and then say that I tried to warn them? Well, you have to try to stop that from happening. All right, then we go back to the regular See stuff that he says. See you later, okay. And he goes back to bed, leaving me to figure out this mess. How do I use that ladder? Oh! Sheesh. Alright, I am tempted to look. It's hard, but nobody's around. It worked. Wait, read, read what? As Akaba Patrick S. Railing four six. Hmm. Oh, psh. yeah, vowel poverty. So the vicar or plead for them to run. Hmm. Okay, what could be against Henry's better judgment, I've decided to warn them. However, I have a feeling that if she's going for the one true faith, uh, they're not going to run. But right now, she's also at least separate from everybody else. Mistress Bower? What is it you need? I've come to ask something of you. Have you? And just who are you, young man? I work with the vicar. I want to help you. Uh, just, I work with the vicar. I know this will sound like madness, but I'm one of the vicar's men. Oh, I see. So it's the devil who sent you. In that case, my time is up. Don't worry. I'll come quietly. No. No, that, that's not how it is. So, what is it you want? I want to ask you not to confess to the vicar. Just take your husband and get out of here while there's still time. I have no idea why you're so taken with my fate, or how you found out about my intentions. But I'll tell you one thing. Changing my mind is out of the question. I won't betray my faith, nor my brothers in Christ. Okay. 
So let's consider for a moment, since I don't seem to have any time limit on here, uh, according to my stats over there, any of these should work to beat her numbers. But as I've seen this game in the past, that isn't always true. So let's see. I know how awful it feels to turn and run. I did it once myself. Did I? I suppose I had to. You won't be the only one to suffer for your choice. Certainly true. God gives you the chance to escape. Or what about your husband? Okay. So... I think I'm tend to do with this one because I think she would be more moved. Uh, she might be moved toward God or toward her faith. But now you've got a chance to escape. Surely you won't throw it away. I won't oppose God's will for me. For heaven's sake, woman! If it were God's will you should burn, it would have happened a long time ago. You can't know that. <laughs> and don't you think the investigation is dragging on a bit? Do you think nobody in the village speaks badly of you? Don't fool yourself. Those old people from the farm who keep to themselves, they're ripe for denouncing, aren't they? And yet nobody's come to arrest you so far. It may just be that God is giving you time to get away. You may be right, but I can't lie. It's against all my teaching. You won't have to lie if you're never asked any questions. Just leave. You can preach elsewhere. I'm sure you have lots of friends who'd love to take you in. But I don't want to run. No one wants to run away, but sometimes we have no choice. If you run, your faith will live on. That must mean something. You're right. I shouldn't give in so easily. I've just grown so weary of the endless persecution. You should pack up and run away as soon as you can. The vicar might get here any minute. Thank you. Don't delay. God bless. So that seems like an objective completed, but that may not be true. Like, she's still there doing that. And watch, then the vicar will come striding right down the road. Let me just see where we are in the journal. So, by 5% of the fleet runs with the family right away. Hopefully they'll escape because that blood risk vicar. More importantly, let's hope he doesn't find out it was I who warned them. So I still need to report to the vicar, I assume. But hopefully, by that time, she's escaped. Yeah, by the looks of it, she's well on her way of escaping now. She's halfway to the border. Oh, I'm going to be dead. I think this is where I give the game the opportunity to take my time getting back. Oh heck, I could really take my time and just go uh, beat up some guys in the woods. I might as well do that next, right? There he is. Gonna at least wash up in the trough first. For all I know, maybe there's a secret game mechanic that I should wait at least 12 or 24 hours before reporting back to the guy. Huh. I mean, there very well can be if you report to him too early in this game. I didn't consider it earlier. There is bard potions, and I have more than one. I might actually need to gulp that real quick. I have five for ten minutes. There we go. I'm honored that a knight such as you takes an interest in me. 
I found them, Monsignor. Pardon me? I found the heretics. Really? And who are they? The Bauer family and their entire household. Hmm. Well, I expect you to give me some evidence. In the last few days, I've been hearing how practically everyone here is a heretic. I found that place the captive heretic talked about, and I found a family cross there. It took a bit of asking around, but I learned it belongs to the Bowers. Their farm isn't far from here, to the north. And then all I had to do was go there and do a little spying. What of it? What did you hear? Nothing at all. The farm was deserted, not a living soul anywhere. Ha! Oh. They fled. So they are heretics. What will you do, Monsignor? It's not the first time the Devil's Spawn has fled from me. I'll do the same as always. Track them down and capture them. Don't worry, they won't get far. Thank you for your help. You may leave. Good luck to you. Give word to Sir Hanash. And hope this won't come back to bite me and the buttocks. Well, the good news, as long as I'm here in the north, there's a bandit camp over there that deserves to get sacked. I think I'm going to stick with the dagger. Normally for humans you want armor crushers. Might have an encampment right here. This is the camp. I'm a bit too much in the open. Hmm. Whoop, I don't want to fall in here and get trapped. skeletons so it's gonna go further in Okay, yeah, we have contact. We've got a tent up there. I can see what looks like one guy with a helmet on. I'm in the daylight, so sneaking up, not exactly a good option. guy down there or not. No, it's a fence post. I'm surprised I haven't ran into a sentry yet. Wow, it's be like one or two guys that are already asleep, taking a nap, and I would have missed my chance getting them. So I could hear voices. Did I just grab attention?
guard down there. Guard one around the pot. There's a guy there. Even if I try to bow shot, I'm a little farther away. Oh, that's an archer. There's an archer and an armored guy moved down to the pot. Okay, four of them. Four of them all eating. And you got one moving off. I don't really have anything to poison stuff with. He moved way off. I'd love to try to get a stealth kill on him. I might be able to do. I am going to try it. I moved in for an opportunity. The main armored guy is here. Everyone's at the campfire. I might be able to get in a stealth kill. Oh. <laughs> oh, didn't work. We got rabbit. To the horse. Oh, he's right there, wasn't he? He's still there. Will you follow me all the way to town? Okay. I get a chance to come around now and actually nail him. Up on this thing. Ah, oh, he went back into the woods. See if I can still catch up with him quick, because I think he's separated from the rest. down there again. Problem is there's still too many for me to handle alone. I had almost snuck up on that one. I could possibly take out the archer. If I could get close enough for a good shot. see. I don't be too close, but let's try this. Oh. Did I get him? Oh, 
Not sure they did. Hey, Utwan, Vidyas. All right, now time to run. Oh, they're right on me. Hey, it's getting close. We have to, uh... Ow! Oh. oh, I'm stuck in the bushes. Come on. I need to use a tree. Oh, I don't want that. Oh, there we go. This is weird. We're stuck on some weird. <laughs> it's hard to see here. Okay, don't lock up with that guy, I guess. There we go. I got him again. Hey, watch out for this guy. Oh, and an archer. Oh, I'm targeting the archer for some reason. I need to finish off this guy. Oh, I'm tired. Okay, get the archer, get the archer. Okay. Yeah, we're about this guy now. Break off from him. Oops, break off from him. Get the archer. He won't let me break off. Oh. Uh, this is... I hate when I have to lock combat with... He's almost down. I just keep stabbing. I am blocking. Oof, oof, There we go. Sheesh. And Archer must have already took off and all that. Well, let's loot what we need. Wow, uh, some of these are worth quite a bit of money. Hmm. I 
gets to be heavy though. Well, I could, I could carry it or get on the horse. She did pretty well there as far as keeping myself alive. And see where his uh, sword went. And I don't suppose, like I say, I don't suppose the archer stuck around. And I'm a little disoriented as where the other guy would have dropped during that whole fight. I just have to look around a little bit. See if I can find the other body. Oh, hello. So, this is where his weapons went. Is he in here somewhere? I remember this was part of the tangled mess we were fighting in. Yeah, we didn't come out this far. Let's see. And there might be one more opponent here. Yep. The archer's down there. But I've made the archer fled, right? So there could be a second guy. I'm kind of stuck in bushes again. Who is this motto? Yeah, I am stuck. All right, let's get an opening shot here. Huh, wake up shot. And he's down. Hunting arrows. I can use a little dried meat and some groschen. And there, that camp is done. And just in time, too, we could use some nourishment. I was just, I've been thinking there had to have been another guy around. I guess not. Digestive potion? Oh, reduces overstuffing and cures food poisoning. You know, it might be a reason to have that. Oh, look at the groschen they got here. And this, and this. Padfoot potion, Nighthawk potion. So after quite a bit of searching there, I never did find the second human's body. And I was doing it from I was doing it from foot. I wasn't doing it on horseback because 
as you can see, even with the increase in height here, it's not the, and that's the original body that I had, uh, even with the increased height, it's not easy to find another body laying around. So, I'm going to be short and reporting an ear, I guess. What? It was right over there. Why am I going all the way back here? This is where I wish you could, like, break a fast travel. It's like this is a long wind-up attack on the road. Can I scout it? I don't know if I can. We'll see what I can do. Success in scouting it, but... Oh, there. There's a guy right over there. Back the horse up. I have half a mind not to mess with it, but let's let's get some more combat experience in. Just notice my perk. Say this. When you draw an opponent's blood, it gives you a plus one strength bonus. Yeah, let's go for that. guy here. Is he the only one? He's the only one I can see. Drop body. Sometimes there is a second one, I'm just not seeing one. So that might be the only one. I'm gonna put my stuff on. Pause guns, move to the horse. Yeah, I see. They changed the train because like they put the tree there. I hope I can be of some humble service to you. I have some trophies. Show me. They deserved it, the bastards. 
I've taken care of that camp. Have you brought me proof? Here it is. I'm delighted to hear it. It's not over yet. I've heard of some trouble along the Robda Road. There's bound to be another encampment there. Most likely in an abandoned mine in the woods. Very well. I'll take a look there. <laughs> Turn the quest appropriate that Sir Hanush is in the chapel again. God bless you. What troubles you? There we go. It's all sorted out, sir. You've no need to worry about the vicar anymore. Excellent. Some good news at last. I've heard some pretty wild rumors from Ujits. So, what happened there exactly? Maybe this <laughs> will surprise you, sir. But there really were heretics in Ujits. Are you telling me the vicar didn't come to stick his nose in my possessions? I don't know about that, but he definitely suspected there were heretics hereabouts, and he was right. Christ! A man doesn't expect that sort of thing in his own fiefdom. Did you catch them? I warned them they've left. <laughs> Let's not do that. Let's do this. No, they ran away. The vicar's investigation wasn't exactly low-key. Anyway, they've definitely fled beyond your estate. Well, that's at least something. And the vicar? He's probably hot on their heels. Hmm, well, I hope he doesn't come back. Anyway... Yeah, I hope he doesn't either. With that vicar. You pulled a thorn from my side. Here's a little token of my gratitude. Thank you, sir. Goodbye. St. Michael's sword. Oh, and a lot of Groshen. Let's check out the sword. He did give me uh, a nice piece of armor last, and I think it's this Madiber Curios. I can definitely use it. So, D58-3... Well, I don't know how much I'll use it, but definitely a nice sword worth hanging on to. Now I have to find the next great quest. Alright folks, thanks for watching me through to another conclusion uh, episode of Kingdom Come Deliverance. And next time we're going to work our way uh, basically on the main quest, going back up to Merhoed. And uh, there was a raider captured there, and we have a friend, Matthias, we got to learn what's going on. So it's back on the main quest line next time. Again, I very much appreciate your likes, shares, subscribe, please, trying to build the channel. And uh, check out the earlier video games that I've been playing. Hey, thank you very much.